What is up? I'm Moana Turtle, and today we have another Pokemon opening. We're doing another two boxes of Hidden Fates, the two ball collections. We have one Ultra, one Great. I went to League last night, tried a couple new decks, and also did a bunch of trading. And um, so we traded a bunch of Hidden Fates stuff. So we need to kind of like repopulate our binder. Um, and obviously, we're looking for that shiny Charizard. Price has gone down immensely, but uh, we're looking for number two that we can pull it. So uh, we also have a Mail Day. Huge shout out to Eric. Thank you so much for this package. We'll see what he sent us. This is the second package that he sent us. So, um, lots to do. Let's begin. All right, we cracked into our first box. Before we begin, a uh, small mail day is that we picked up some new Funko Pops at GameStop. They had a sale where you pick up three, you get one for free. And so we picked up some Warhammer 40K. This is the Ultra Ultramarines Intercessor. And then we got Pikachu. This was the last one we needed from the Pokemon Fungos. And I think she, this is the first one that came out. So it's kind of ironic that this is the last one we picked up. So we got all the Pokemon. Here is the promo Metagross code card for you guys. And let's get into these first 10 packs. Uh, we'll open our mail from Eric. Thanks again, Eric. Halfway through the video. And let's get into our first pack Charizard pack art. See what we can do shout out to Rowan and everyone else that I have been meeting over at the league it's great to meet you guys play with you guys and also trade okay first pack one is fairy energy Misty's gym lieutenant surge Pokemon Center lady I've been using LT surge for my baby trio deck Managed to pull it off a couple times, but then I can't finish because like I just don't have enough damage output to take out their last remaining Pokemon. Might need to figure out maybe I can put in like a great catcher, so at least I can face whatever GX I want. If it's a non-GX, I'm pretty confident we can win. Uh, but yeah, when you're up against just a um, you know, like a tag team or something, it's hard to deal enough damage. All right, Misty's determination, Metapod. Charmeleon, Geodude, Cubone, Eevee, a Clefairy, Psyduck, Jolteon, and then all right, our first shiny is a Magnemite. I feel like we pull a lot of these Magnemites. There are certain ones we just get. I think like Magnemite and Curlier come to mind as far as the ones we pull most frequently. And because this is from the box, yeah, the white is the shiny markers are just really intense. And the border, I always feel like it's a little dark. And then the kind of like the yellow or the white just really pops. All right, so we got our first shiny, not bad. As always, guys, we're looking for like a 50% pull rate. So that's one. We're looking for five out of this box. And obviously, the biggest card that we could hit would be that shiny Charizard. So we got one shiny, and let's see if we can't get a GX. Been a while since we pulled a gold card as well. Wouldn't mind getting another one of those. Psyduck, Magikarp, Staryu, a Slowpoke, Eevee is our rare slot, not bad. And then, oh, Shiny Altaria. Oh, I actually might have traded one of these, so I think I needed to replace that slot in my binder, so that might have been a quick replace. Let me grab a perfect fit for you. All right, three packs in. Two hits, one of them is a GX. Very nice start to this opening. So I think I do want to do deck profiles. I'm still trying to work out the kinks before I narrow my list to exactly 60. But uh, right now we have three decks and that is a Malamar Giratina. Um, pretty stock list to be honest. And then a Reshiram deck and then a baby's deck and we're also going to work on a trevenant dust noir with mischievous support and also a reshizard slash um, charizard brixen so if you think you want to see a deck profile of any of those uh, let me know in a comment down below and i'm sure we can set that up next pack we have a arbuck and then just a charmander reverse so we are at that 50 percent hit rate and four packs in I think we do have something here as always guys if you do want to support the channel um, actually we've been increasing the number of ways to do so 
Uh, our simplest ways are to hit that like button down below and also sub if you are not already subscribed. And we do stream on Twitch and YouTube every Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday. So another, ooh, Giovanni's Exile. It's been a little bit since we pulled the last version of you. <laughs> Although we have pretty high count. Really love this art. But we have recently become affiliated with Twitch. So um, if you do happen to catch a stream, and uh, yeah, there's plenty of ways to support through there as well. Even if it's just hitting that follow button. Greatly appreciated. So hit number three, and it is a full art supporter, although it's not from the shiny vault. It's from the main set. But we will definitely take it. Love those rocket full arts. I think the Jesse and James might be one of the best supporter arts out there. Although some of the tag team ones are giving a good run for their money. All right, we got electric energy. Pokemon Center. I'm not sure if there's a full art version of her. Misty's Gym, Geodude, Pikachu, Clefairy, Cubone, Jigglypuff, Blaine's Last Stand is our rare, and then a Kangaskhan. Ooh, definitely got something here. Hopefully it's something good. Alright, Fairy Energy, a Farfetch'd, Graveler, Chansey, Psyduck, Pikachu, Magikarp, Coughing, a Clefairy, Snorlax, ooh, Zergatry, oh wait, Snorlax is the rare, and Zergatry, Shiny GX, I'm not even sure if I have this, this might be my first one, uh, so great pull right there. Sometimes I think we're getting close to completing the set and then we do a bunch of trades like, all right, we need to recoup. So um, I'm not sure if Zergatry's in the binder right now, but if not, he definitely will be. And uh, yeah, there's been a new influx of subscribers. So thank you so much, all you guys for the support and welcome to the channel. Uh, we do a lot of openings like this, but we try to do a lot of other content as well, whether it's looking at the market, at the singles market, um, we do a lot, we stream a lot of PTCGO, so we'll try to do some videos there as well. And if you do have any suggestions, I'm always open to anything. Just let me know in a comment down below. All right, Farfetch, Graveler, Chansey, Eevee, Pikachu, Clefairy, Jigglypuff, a Caterpie. Clefable is our rare. That's always a little disappointing. And then, oh, the uh, lesser version of Giovanni. All right, four hits. We have two more packs. As long as we get one hit from one of these packs, we will consider this a adequate box. <laughs> no home runs, but uh, very solid opening. You know, got two shiny GXs. And if we remember back when this set first dropped, Oh my gosh, it took like 50 packs to find our first shiny GX when the curse was real. Those are rough times. Although, I, I was able to laugh about it, but yeah, that was rough. All right, Slowpoke, Eevee is our hollow rare. And then Justin Paris saying, uh, yeah, go to the next pack. There's nothing here. All right, on to the last pack of the first box, and then we're going to crack into Eric's mail. Really excited to see what he sent us this time. And a huge shout out to you. Thank you so much for all your support. He is Twitch subscriber number two. Shout out to Get Wrecked as number one. All right, Misty's Determination, Pokemon Center Lady, Metapod, Coughing, Ekans, Cubone, Magikarp, Geodude, Arbuck again. And are we going to come up one short? Ah! Unfortunately, we did come up one short, but. Uh, so I would say this is slightly below average, but hey, we got two shiny GXs, so not too bad, not too bad. All right, we're going to clean up and get ready for a second opening and get into the mail. All right, so quickly, we got two other Funkos, and we actually picked up one of these already. The box is a little damaged, unfortunately, in shipping. Uh, but I do want to give 
gift one of these for Christmas to a relative of mine that is a fan of this stuff. So got another one of that Warhammer cart, uh, Funko, and we got Seto Kaiba to go with the blue eyes that we already have. I feel like Seto is really cool. Like you know, yeah, Yugi was the king of games, but Seto was always so strong, and um, I love his demeanor. I feel like a lot of his jokes are underappreciated. Uh, and kind of like his mannerisms but uh, let's get into what Eric sent us um, if you ever do want to send us we have this in always in our description this PO box address you can address it to Jonathan L if you want or I want a turtle and this is always awkward to open almost knocked the mic over that would have been terrible and he did say that we could read the message out loud so we'll definitely do that make sure we have everything out of here once again, thank you so much, Eric, a.k.a. EMC. All right, there's a bunch of stuff in here. Ooh, Bill from the uh, good old base set. Bill seemed like a pretty broken card. Just a straight-up draw, too. What is going on here? Hope this makes it. Oh, yeah, I really appreciate it because you actually sent this twice. If you're reading it, it means you, you have received my package that was returned back to me because the post office failed to acknowledge there is a water turtle out there in the world. You know, other people, I feel like other people have successfully sent it to that, addressing it to I want a turtle though. What is this? In this package, there is a first edition card. Oh my, I kind of doubted this one, but a couple, a second edition. Okay, very cool. The three starters. Oh my gosh, I, that would be insane if that's any of them. All right, here we go. Let's see what else we have. In, in all the messed up, a taped card holder, there is a rare card inside. So be careful with the unwrapping of the tape and pulling of the card. I think you'll like it. Oh, I'm sure I will. And if you'd like to send a Cosmic Clip code my way, I wouldn't mind. Oh, for sure. Um, I can never seem to get them in videos quick enough. I hope you enjoy the mail. Keep up the good work. Hopefully we can play against each other this week. For sure, EMC. Um, what is your friend code in P... Pogo. Oh yeah, I can definitely send that to you. And what we have on the back? A rare energy card. <laughs> oh, that's really cute. I actually really like that. We're going to post this right in the background. Let's see. Yeah. Okay, let's see what we have here. Whoa! Oh, this is another custom card. Very cool. And, uh, hmm, this will be a little tricky. So now let's see, take a look at some of these raw cards first. like that one last and to start we have a miracle berry this looks like it's from the neo i'm actually not familiar with it and it is first edition that is sweet that's a lot of text i'm not gonna go through that thank you so much eric bill from base set two yeah it's a pretty broken card haha <laughs> potion classic and then here comes team rocket i think it's actually a rare oh wow so a rare trainer from the rocket set very cool and another potion let's see what we have in this sleeve from a hidden fates etb Ooh, what is this darkness i think this is the one that yeah deals 10 damage to you when you attach it uh yeah they kind of made dark and metal energies very like special energies when they first introduced and um oh attacks you 10 extra damage nice all right now let's get into this we're going to be careful and look at this custom card. That art is amazing. So we did get a shiny Charizard in this video. <laughs> and oh, wow, that looks amazing. Thank you so much. He sent us like um, a, I think it was a Dark Lugia last time. It was really cool. All right, I'm just going to cut real quick to me getting this open because I'm going to be careful. I don't want to rush. All right, so we got the tape off of these um, ETB dividers. And is this a pack of cards? Oh, it is open pack. So there is a card inside. This top loader. And all right, we got another sleep card. Wow, this is getting super protected. It's like getting to vault. Maybe it's the shiny vault. All right, here we go. Thanks again, Eric. That was super generous of you. And uh, yeah, we'll definitely hook you up. Just let me know what. <laughs> I was like. <laughs> it's. <laughs> Oh man, that was good. <laughs> uh, that was a roller coaster of emotions. 
And what is this, like quadruple sleeved? All right, might have to fast forward in the video. Cut cut to when I finally get this card out. Oh, there we go. All right, is there anything else inside? All right, and for the last card, we have, ooh, Shiny Mew from Shiny Legends. I'm not sure if I have this one. I think I have like the Ho-Oh and um, the Genesec. Wow, greatly appreciate it. Let me grab some sleeves for this card. So let's see, to summarize, we have a custom Shiny Charizard, a, <laughs> where's the other one? A proxy Shiny Charizard, this cute Shiny Charizard baby, a very cool Emerald Dark Energy, and then some super vintage trainers. Very nice. Thank you so much, Eric. And uh, all right, it is time to crack into our next Hidden Fates box. Be right back. All right, let's get into box number two. We are just going to sleeve up our new shiny Zorark. I believe this still, still is actually really useful in control, a control deck and expanded. So one day we'll take the dive into expanded. I feel like standard has plenty of excitement to offer and uh, probably much cheaper too. You, you belong in a double sleeve, that's for sure. Here is a code card for a Zorark. Put you off over here. And hopefully these shinies will give us some luck in this next 10 packs. All right, let's do this. Three shiny Charizards in the background. Can it produce a fourth for us? Pack number one, here we go. All right, Jinx, Misty, Brock's Gym, Geodude, Clefairy, Eevee, Ekans, A Paris, Jesse, and James. Ooh, Hiker, Full Art Supporter. These Full Art Supporters are super hard to pull. So I am pumped about that. I definitely don't have this one. I actually have no idea what this does. Look at the type five card. Either player deck and choose one of them. That player shuffles the other cards back in their deck and put that card on top of the deck. Hmm. That doesn't sound that good. <laughs> uh, pretty cool. Pretty cool arts. One I don't have. Underwhelming. Underwhelming text. I will. Let's just leave it at that. But hey, we got a full art supporter. Very nice. Great start to this second box. So Sword and Shield is just around the corner. I am so excited, so pumped. Hope to have some content out for you guys in the near future. Although I'm not really sure what the kind of content where uh, people will want to see. If you have any ideas, let me know in a comment. All right, let's see. Paris, Brock's training. And then, oh, that is a Eevee, shiny evolution. Any shiny evolution is always a win. Uh, Although it seems like the, the by far the favorite is that Umbreon. So I feel like, and uh, we actually gave our first one away. Shout out to you, Pokemon lover. So I feel like if all the Umbreons we pull will quickly be, <laughs> will be uh, traded off or something one way or another. But uh, hey, we got another Espeon. Two for two. This box is doing amazing. Can we keep that streak going? tall order but uh, I think we can do it here we go we got a grass I feel like these cards are kind of warped Malamar Charmeleon Jinx Staryu Jigglypuff Ekans Geodude Cubone Ooh, Charizard ah we got blown out in league to Mewtwo leveraging this Charizard. 
kind of unfortunate, but I feel like this is the most useful card to come out of Hidden Fates as far as the meta goes. Three for three. Amazing. And even though we pulled a non-shiny GX, if we had to pull one, like that is the definitely the card we want to see. This box is on fire. Just give me a different Charizard. <laughs> if I can be greedy. Here we go. Electric energy. Farfetched. Brock. Misty's Gym, Charmander, a Cleave Fairy, Slowpoke, Magikarp, Pikachu, a Jolteon is our rare, and then Paris. On to the next pack says Paris. All right, we finally hit our first, had our first miss. It's crazy. Man, yeah, these are all these packs are kind of warped a little bit. Let's see what else is coming out in the near future. We got the Sword and Shield kind of uh, starter pro, like uh, sneak peek kind of cards. Although I think it's just the promos. And then for there, it just probably comes with Cosmic Eclipse packs. We have the Ultra Premium Super Duper box, Hidden Fates, and we'll definitely do at least one of those for the channel. And then I'm not sure what's after that. Uh, Sword and Shield, you can actually already pre-order it, but that won't be out till February, so yeah, what are we going to be doing until then? <laughs> I'm not sure. Giovanni, I guess we'll just be, uh, you know, hitting that Sword and Shield game hard, as hard as we can. LT Surge, Caterpie, Paris, Ekans, Psyduck, Staryu, Bill's Analysis, actually a very good card. And then we have, ooh, Magnezone, nice. Another shiny. We got the Magnemite and the Magnezone in this video. Don't think I need the Magneton, but it'd be kind of cool to pull, pull the whole line. So, so far we are already at four hits. We have four more packs to, so securing that 50%, I really like our chances. Actually, let's get to six so we can make our whole two box opening uh, to get that 50% of 10 hits all together. And if we can exceed that, obviously that would be even better. If we did the pack trick incorrectly, Blaine's Last Stand is our rare. Whoops. Dark Energy, Misty's Gym, Sabrina, Metapod, Psyduck, Staryu, Cleef Fairy, Slowpoke, Ooh, Kalisapod. This one I did trade as well recently. So it's nice to replace you. I do like this card. So we are going back in the binder. And it seems like you're really popular, so <laughs> not sure how long you'll stay, but uh, glad to have you back. Very cool card, especially with that first impression. All right, five hits for this box, and now we're in bonus. We're in the bonus rounds now. Three more tries. Let's keep this crazy pulls coming. All right, fighting energy. Giovanni, Brox Gym, Koga, Voltorb, Pikachu, Ekans, Coughing, Paris, a Lapras. This card does not do Lapras justice. And then another Megalite. <laughs> when I sort of saw the metal and like the, the Pokemon, I thought we pulled the the whole evolutionary line. Guys, like we're a we are a magnet for these magnemites. Seriously. We pull so many of them. Two in one video. And that is hit number six. So we've captured at least that 50% pull rate. So I'm chalking up. Overall, this is a very successful opening. Very happy with the results. A huge number of shiny GXs. A full art supporter. We still got two more packs. All right, we got Nurse Joy, Metapod, Misty's Gym, Psyduck again, Pikachu, the Bubbles, Magikarp, Coughing, Clefairy, Electrode is our rare, and then, oh my god, another fall. All right, Zorark killed it this time. What an amazing box. Two full art supporters and two that we need. Lady, I have no idea what you do. Search your deck for four basic energy cards, reveal them, and put them into your hand. That's actually pretty good. I'm trying to think. Um, 
there's I think it's like there are I can't remember which which Pokemon are but if you have one of those Pokemon that's kind of like place as many energies as you want from your hand or something like that that sounds pretty good and I like the art it's very simple don't even know who lady is is that like uh, like kind of like bug catcher that's just what they call like those trainers all right last pack for to wrap up an amazing hidden face opening I feel like we have outperformed like re recently guys we did a video where we opened every single kind of hidden face product if you haven't seen it definitely go check it out um, especially for the number of packs like this this opening tops it for sure all right we have a dark energy jinx Charmeleon, Chansey, Charmander, Psyduck, Magikarp, Staryu, Slowpoke, Brock's Training. So once again, thank you, Eric, so much. Uh, as always, guys, like, comment, and subscribe. Follow us on Instagram, join our Discord, and catch us on stream Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday, 7 p.m. EST. And we have ooh, a reverse Eevee. But amazing opening. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Wanna Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time.